Hi everyone, Victor here with another quick update on my 3D engine. Um, if you follow me on Twitter, you saw that I post uh, an animated GIF about this black and white post processing on the shader. So yeah, I've I've started to mess with post processing on the shader so we can um, give another look to our game on a 3d engine but what I'm here to talk about today is this red box around the model this is a bounding box um, we use it to detect collision between two models this is the basics the the most basic form of collision detection uh, is a uh, axis aligned bounding box a a b b i think that's what they call it so it's mathematically um, easy to compute to the to determine if a bounding box um, a non rotated bounding box is uh, colliding with another bounding box so what my update for this version does is when you import a 3d model it automatic creates a new bounding box around the model for you so here we have our model the pirate girl so let's pirate girl so let's import another model with another texture let us see, yes, it's working. It automatically creates this bounding box around uh, any model that you import, so you don't have to manually uh, import a bounding box. Rock 4. As you guys can see, uh, the Rock 4 model is composed by all these rocks but it's uh, just one model so the bounding box is computed around uh, around the model not the objects inside the model okay so if you want a, a bounding box uh, separately for each object you have to split these rocks for instance into uh, other uh, standalone models to be honest you can fluster them like that uh, and expect to get a bounding box around each and every every one of, of the rocks let, let me see a more I, re I really don't know um, let me see we have a house I think it's house 2 house 2 okay let me see house 2 it's a mess the way I'm organizing these models and textures it's how it's true but that's not important for now later I'll be fixing that yes it's too big let's uh, also scale it down not too much 0 0.2 is fine I guess okay Yep, doesn't matter the model, um, the bounding box works for every model. So that's it for now, it's a small update, but I've been working this weekend because things in my, my job are crazy right now and I have a deadline to meet, so I cannot spend as much time as I, I would like working on the 3D engine. That's it for it. I hope you guys like it. Um, follow me on Twitter if you want to see small updates and don't like to watch my videos, uh, listen to my broken English. See you guys. Bye.